<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Bobby. Back with more Rissetier, uh Part 2. We're back in the dungeon. And um, if you enjoyed the series as much as I am so far, then thank you for being here. Um, We're just starting to... Um, destroy that guy. We're just starting to get into the thick of things. What's that? What the... What was that? That was a bomb. Orange! I got orange. It, it like went up and I was like, it's gonna explode. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god. This guy hits a lot. I have to not get hit by these guys at all. So I remember in the last episode it said if I died, I get to keep at least one item that I found. <laughs> so let's not die. Let's try to get as far as possible and get to this Hall of Trials. Because um, I think this guy, to be an adventure, he needs to beat this place. Ooh, he levels up. And when you level up, you get some... You get a experience up. Wait, this next floor? No, no, no. Let's explore this fully and get all the freaking treasure. Yeah! What? Oh, God. I hit six. Come on. Getting beat up by slimes? So, I love the randomized dungeon aspect. Um, It's just... I, I don't know. Everything looks pretty cool. It looks like the kind of game I would you know, love to play. And I'm playing it right now, so there you go. Critical hit. So. Alright. Seriously, though, where are all the treasure chests? Damn you, slimes. I wonder if there's, like, bosses and stuff. Ah. It seems like I'm gonna get a lot of money. What's this? <gasps> Pick that up. Whatever she said. Yay! Picked up an ingredient. I think, um, it said, like, question mark ingredient. Pretty sure, like, at the end of this thing, if I do survive it, it'll tell me exactly what it is. Oh, there it is. Oh no! Slime attack! Alright, cool. Destroyed them all. Nice, nice, nice. Woo! Sweetness. Alright, what's in here? <gasps> we found, um, summer sandals. wonder if he can wear that. Summer sandals. Can you wear that? Yeah, he can. Gives my defense up by two. I'll wear it. So... Yep, it doesn't seem to show on my character, but eh, it doesn't matter anymore. Um, I can have up to 20 different items in my pouch, as if you didn't see it. Right now I have 8 out of 20, so... Uh, let's go. So that's the bad part about bringing items to help you survive. It's uh, It takes up inventory space. So it's a kind of like a uh, risk-reward type of thing. Clothes. It's basically, it's just called clothes. Let's see if it's actually any good though. Leather armor besides just clothes. Actually no, it puts my thing down by a lot. Okay, so that's it for this dungeon. Let's head to the next floor. Do, 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 do. So there's a lot of cool mechanics in this game. I think it's nice. It seems to, like, most games who, like, try to do this kind of stuff, um, they kind of, like, f do really well in one thing and, like, suck at everything else. Or they just suck at everything. But uh, so far, this one seems to be... Oh, what the hell is that? Ha! What is that? Looks like a kobold. Ah, jeez, it hit me. Huh, drop that apple. That thing's probably gonna heal me. I don't need to use it yet, though. The only thing that I'm not liking right now in the me in the combat is there's no hotkey. Um, you know, that'd be cool if I put hotkeys on, like, if I have, like, apples and, like, just quick heal items I can use. If I have to heal, I'm probably going to have to just keep pressing start and healing from there. So once I get, if I get hit one more time, definitely gonna heal. Keep looking. All right, what do we got? Oh, what's this? Pot stand. What the heck am I gonna do with that? Pot stand. Um, pot stand. Um, a handmade pot stand made of checkered cloth and cotton. Great for protecting tables from hot pots. Actually, that's pretty awesome. Look at the base price, 2400. I could probably sell that for uh, quite a bit more. Um, so one week from today in game, um, I have to pay a loan of 10,000. So, getting a lot of crap from here is really good help. And that probably means, like, oh god, I can change the camera, can't I? No, I can't. Oops. Nope, I can't change the camera angle. Only in your store. So, like I said before, um, using all the money. Oh, let's keep going. Okay, I have to save up 10,000. That means I can't just keep buying random items. So, I have to manage it, make sure I have enough payment for the, you know, for the rent. Etc. Wooden shield. I'm so almost dead. 
but uh, a lot of experience would help. Oh, it seems like picking up those red little gems is the experience. I don't think I'm picking up money after all. Yeah, each of those little gems are experience, so if this isn't money, I'm not getting money. Okay. This should level me up. Level up, level up, level up, level up! Oh, that was close, I got hit. Woo! Awesome. Alright, next floor it is. I think this is the last floor. I mean, this is kind of lengthy for a little tutorial um, dungeon, isn't it? Picked up a wooden armband. What the hell is that? Let's see. What can I get rid of? Wooden armband. I can't wear it. Oh, yeah, you can. You just have to get rid of your... I just have to get rid of my shield if I want to wear it. This is probably for, um, you know, people who can't use shields. <laughs> Next floor it is. That's probably it, right? No? Okay, it must be five. Set a guess. Five little... Oh, jeez! Oh, my God. There's traps, too. Okay, that's a new thing. Good thing I kept running. Ah, back attack. Nice. Sprites are really adorable. <laughs> I just have to say that again. Ooh, critical hit on the box. Come on. What the hell is that? Gotta make sure it doesn't do any range attacks. Keep looking at it. Looks, looks awkward. Oh my god. Okay, Cobalt shoot stuff. Ah. No. It's level 4. Oh my god, hit me 7. See, if you're not careful, these things take a huge chunk of damage to you. So I gotta... Gotta really watch out, figure out what each enemy does, so I can avoid them accordingly. Like these slimes, I can tell they go horizontal or vertical, they all hit to the sides. Picked up a chocolate bar. These guys hit straight too, but I can stagger them. Can't carry any more? What is that though? Okay, I'm gonna have to drop something. Let's drop clothes. Wait, it's a hundred. Okay, what's what's really cheap? Like, less, less than, like, crap. Um, 400, 300, 700 ingredients. I kind of want to keep all the ingredients because I don't know what it's going to make. Okay, we'll drop the clothes. Throw it away. Okay. What's this? Pick up chestnut plus four. Let's check out what that is. Chestnut plus four. Oh, 200. Oh, whatever. Double, double the amount of the uh, clothes. Alright. I'm full on items, so if I if I see the um, next floor button, I'm gonna go ahead and just keep going. I really hope that later on we can maybe increase our bag size, like double or 40 or something like that, because 20 is, is not enough. Nice. Maybe I'll learn like new skills later on too. This isn't cutting it. Oh, that's a new item. Let's pick it up. We'll drop the clothes again. Yeah. These things aren't worth that much. Powerful anti-venom. This thing, I'm pretty sure it's gonna cost a lot. Let's check it out. Powerful anti-venom. 550. Nice. Nice. Okay, what's next? Hmm. More baddies. So these guys don't seem to have any special any special attacks on them. Just run up to you and hit you. One more one more guy. I'm gonna level up. Nice. Pick. Oh, I can't carry more than one of the same item. Oh, shit. Alright, come on, let's go. Oh, jeez. Okay. I really want to pick up the antivenom. It costs a lot, so let's go ahead and just drop another crap item that's only like 100 or 200 or something. Ah, slime fluid. Whatever, get rid of that. Alright, let's go. Where is the button to go to the next floor? He just threw a rock at me, that motherfucker. So I don't know if, ow, if whenever I level up, um, my attack goes up and defense, or is it just what I, I have equipped? Oh man, I can't carry that ingredient. Screw it, no more. I just want to get out of here. Just kill everything on my way so I can level up a little. And um, right before I level up, I'm going to experiment by looking at my stats, and we'll see if anything goes up like right after. I know my HP and um, magic goes up for sure, but I don't know if his base attack and defense goes up. We'll find out though. I just have to remember to look at it before I level up. Let's keep running. Yep, let's go. Is this it? Am I done? Yeah! This might be a boss room. That's why there's a huge chest. Or, I'm just done. We'll see. 
this is. Did I do it? I did, didn't I? Yeah, All right, good job. <laughs> Way to go, Louie. Give me your guild card, you jerk. Hmm. <laughs> I bet something's gonna happen before they open watch. Nothing? Oh. Guild card. Whoa, cards? Oh, that's what he got out of it. Because he, like, finished his little, uh, whatever. His, his, um, his quest. Hmm. <laughs> All right, awesome. Whoa, that's that's the door out, of course. Pretty cool. What's this thing that just showed up? <laughs> As goho? As a goho. Door return. Okay. Yay! Ah, often countered during normal exploration. Just in case. You can always head back to the floor that had a door on it. Oh, that's cool. If you do not... Okay. Awesome. So if, if like... A, oh my god, that means like dungeons could be up to like 20 to 100 levels each. And then I'm going to use these doors as little checkpoints. Oh my god. Returning home takes time. Leaving ends the current contract with our companion. We hire him. Oh no, do I have to use money to hire these guys? Okay. Yeah, let's go home. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Yes, return to town. Clear! Clear! Um, so I have to get rid of one item? Why? Oop, oh no, she's telling me what I got. Yay, we're done. Let's head back to the shop. We did it! Alright, let's go ahead and put some stuff down. All right. Um, what are we gonna put? Let's put an Apple Plus here, and uh, we'll get rid of this worn muffler. We'll put some. What's that one thing I got? There we go. Let's put this powerful anti-venom here, and then we'll keep stocking this with this other crap. Maybe a chocolate bar and an apple. No, no, I already have an apple. I already have an apple. Let's put that orange. Excuse me. Cool, this is great. I have tons of stuff to put here now. The shop's gonna be awesome. Chestnut plus four. So we'll have this one of all new items here. And we'll have this common shield. I think that's enough. I can talk to Tyr, can't I? No, Tyr. Store atmosphere. Lighting gaudy. <laughs> Store atmosphere according, according to Tyr. It kind of sucks. That's cool. Merchant level. Ooh. Huh? Oh, cool. It tells me what kind of stuff. Wow. How many levels? 50 levels? Wow, this is awesome. Okay, so. Starting level. As you work towards the store, your merchant will level rise. Scroll down to see what each level does. Customer sell. Customers may sell items to you. Um, customers may give you a general order. Okay. More items can be found at the guild. You can make fuse items. Change wallpaper. Yay, wallpaper. I guess. Advance orders. Change floors. Um, okay, change carpet. Cool. So, yeah, it's awesome. Wait, what's the other little thing here? Tears lectures. Selling lecture. Oh, no, I'm good. Okay, is that it? Um, yeah. Can I start selling now or something? Open the store. Haha, <laughs> yeah, there was a lot of people in here. You want the orange? This is the legendary. <laughs> Alright, man. Be because we're friends. 128%. Okay, there you go. How about this? Yay! <laughs> Anyone else? Welcome! Ooh, I want to spawn my sword, huh? Eh, it's a little crappy. Alright. 220. Yeah. This is cool. How long do I sell? Oh, okay. I sell according to um, how much time I have left in the day. 
exceeded expectations. All right, sold, bought, found. See, the longer like I can either like sell for a day, or like go in the dungeon, and then the longer like if I go to the dungeon like I did today, I have less time to sell. So that's good. Awesome. Day three. Okay. You know what? Let's sell today. Let's just see what happens. Oh wait, we're gonna talk more. What? What's wrong? Yeah, I gave him a moment. What is it? Concerning the debt. You do? Paying it all back at once. Yeah, I know. Smaller payments weekly. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> oh, God. Alright, so 10000 for the next one for sure. Okay. Let's open up the shop today and we'll see what we can sell. I want to sell a lot more. Sell this dagger. And uh, what else is really expensive? Old muffler, slime fluid, another powerful anti venom. Okay, let's open up shop. Can I like cancel what I want to do? Oh, this guy, huh? He wants my staff? Didn't I just buy that from him? Alright, 400 bucks. How about that? Okay, um, 340. Yay! Okay, what else we got? I think later on, maybe I can sell even more items. Hey, you again, huh? Oh, my chocolate bar. Alright. How about... 120%. Jeez, are you shitting, are you shitting me? Okay, 580. No more than that. Sure. Alright. So it's awesome. I can either use it to sell, or I can... <gasps> oh, he wants my anti-venom. Okay, okay. Here we go. Let's see if he wants this at a super overpriced thing. You get, you need it, old man. Damn it! All right, here, seven hundred. Woo! Still a pretty good profit. Da 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 da. Huh. All right, let's go ahead and restock and um. Yeah, let's restock. And we'll see what else is out there. Maybe I can meet another um, merchant somewhere. Not a merchant. Town Square. Let's see what's in here. <laughs> Maybe I can meet some new adventure or something. Nothing? It'll waste a little bit of time. This action will not take any time. This action will not take any time. Going to a dungeon will take two periods of time. Okay. Chapel it is. What's here? Why are we talking about this at the chapel? <laughs> hmm. Okay, cool. Why are we talking about this? Okay, that was weird. Okay, um... Let's go to the market. Let's see anything okay now one thing I don't know is I'm not sure if um, the items that I equipped on what's his name I think it was Louie I don't know if it stays on him hmm okay let's go ahead and just sell one more time oh no we're talking again holy cow it's late Trying to do some mild management from now on to show you're working in an efficient manner. Yeah, yeah, sure. Scheduled management. Ah. Oh. Four time periods. Morning, afternoon, evening, and night. Alright. Cool. So there's four different parts, huh? So if I go to a dungeon, it takes up two parts. I can sell in the morning. And, um... Let's see, hold on. Um... You can only act between morning and night. When the night ends, you need to get to bed. Trying to run a shop while sleep deprived is unpleasant, so... Close up when it gets late. Two options for each slice. Open the store for a time or go out in town on business. You cannot do both at once. Opening the shop will consume a slice. Returning to the store after going out, regardless of what you do, consumes a slice. Oh, okay. Huh. Alright, got this. Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo -doo. Huh. Dungeoning takes up two slices. Yeah. 
So I should probably leave for dungeon early. Um, if it is dinner night, you have to dust something else. You cannot go. Huh. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, so some days I think I just have to work on the shop, and some days I do adventuring. I think that's what I should do. Okay, awesome. So can I open the shop again? Huh. Anyway, I think I'm gonna save it right now. Let's end it here. If, I, uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. It helps so much. You don't even know. And if you uh, haven't already hit that subscribe button, I upload a lot of daily videos. Please uh, keep throwing more comments about this game. Tell me, do you want to see more of this? Um, I'm really curious to see how far I can go and what other stuff I can do. So thanks so much for being here. Let me know what your thoughts are, and I'll see you next time. them. So far, I've only found one. Whoa. Whoa. Look at the. Oh my god, look at that mama cow. Holy cow! <laughs> Holy cow! Really? He's charging up! What's he doing? What's he doing? Let's kick his ass! Leave that poor cow! Ooh!